we're gonna do um, I'm gonna show everybody uh, MXT just finished the arena um, last night recorded a few matches um, edited them down a little bit the following uh, contest is here we go we got highlights from uh, Mika Asami versus Alexa Bliss. The WWE Universe more than ready to see this one start. The reason for uh, this match is, um, well, it was fairly uh, popular. Both of the both of their clips were fairly popular in uh, the YouTube shorts. So I'm having them face off against each other. Here right now. Now I was playing this match. Um, I was playing as Mika in, in this matchup against Alexa Bliss. Uh, she recently uh, she recently destroyed me in a match. I tried saying it's because I wasn't. Or I hadn't played in a while, so I was rusty, but she kicked my ass. So, uh, this is me trying to get some, uh, some revenge. <laughs> trying to win this matchup as Mika. The match gets underway. Throw a drop kick. Bliss has other ideas. And as you, as you see, she makes very quick work of me. <laughs> In this match, I, I tried to reverse, I tried to reverse, and it just was not working out. And every time I, every time I felt like I had the advantage in this matchup, Alexa would reverse or do something crazy, and it was just so difficult. Like I, I think I actually got some offense in here. Yep, we jumped to the outside. Land that flying crossbody on her, and she just she threw me right into the side of the ring. Like this was a freaking crazy ass match. I ended up having the advantage there again, so I decided to try and throw her out of the ring. We're gonna go for an elbow drop here, and uh, land it right on her, right on her chest. Throw her back in the ring going after her and, and then she got back in control again and started hitting these DBTs and my health was just my character's health was just going down and going down fast this is when the button mashing comes into play I barely was able to kick out of that one but uh you can tell the crowd was really, really into this match. They wanted us to fight forever. Here we go. She went for another DDT and went for another pinfall. And this time, I just didn't have it in me. My thumbs and my hand gave out, and Alexa would once again get the win in a match against me. So it, it continues, guys. I still was not able to defeat her in a matchup yet. But uh, I'm working on it. I am definitely working on it. She kicked my ass that time. It's all all fair. I even played a few singles matches ahead of this to like try and get get the uh, get the rust out. But she still kicked my ass. So yeah. Next week we'll see if I can uh, defeat her with a different call. Yep, once again, Alexa Bliss kicked my ass. Yep, it happened. And she's just telling the referee, raise my damn hand. Like, she's basking in the glory of winning this matchup. And then that led us to this match. Which is the debut of Sue Kobayashi. Making her way down to the ring. 
Maybe even lose a match once in a while. <laughs> she is a call that I uh, just recently made. She is based on Shiri from Stardom. So this would be the uh, the second match that I that I had uh, or that I did in this arena. Uh, this one is another um, going to be another highlight reel match where it cuts from bit to bit. Uh, this was an AI versus AI match. Uh, so I did not play as either of these characters. So here we go. Referee letting the match start. And Sue would uh, quickly take control uh, throwing DD into the corner. And just applying pressure from the start. But, um, DD did get some some uh, some offense in in this matchup, uh, and she has been getting offense in in the other shows that she's been in. Hell, today she got a ton of offense in, in her matchup um, earlier against Starlight, and it almost looked like DD was going to win that match. All right, so Sue would uh, pick her up here. She's going to hit her hit her finisher right here. Um, and go for the pin. One, two, three, and that would be it for this matchup. As uh, it's going to take us to the uh, censored replay screen again. I'm going to point it out this time. Oh, no, I cut it out. That's right. So, um, the entire, like, replay thing was all blurry, and you didn't see anything that was going on in the replay, but, uh, Sue would take that win, and it was a dominant, dominant victory, um, by Sue Kobayashi, and then that would lead us to this match right here, Wildcat versus California Kid. In this match, we are going to play for you in full, so... Just to let you guys know, the winner of this match will get a match on Octane next week against the World Cruiserweight Champion Delvin McLeod, and the title will be on the line. Yes, the title will be on the line next week. Winner of this matchup, these two cruiserweights, whoever wins this match challenges Delvin next week. Oh, I don't have enough balls. Ah, oh, that's fine. Which is why I have plenty of experience. That was when I wish I had those silly sound sound bites. But this man right here, the California kid. He is set to do some amazing things this year. And, and not only in Octane. So it just felt fitting to show him off tonight in this matchup against Wildcat. Wildcat going to the top rope. By the way, shout out to uh, to One King Entertainment, uh, King James Mack for Wildcat. And uh, California Kid working away on Wildcat. Uh, Cali Kid, a uh, surfer in his free time. You can catch him uh, trying to catch big waves when he's not wrestling. It's normally what he does. Um, we, we had to actually go try to find him. I had to send somebody to go find him to get him out here for this matchup. We haven't seen him in a few weeks, so it's Good to finally have him back. So he's, uh... Where we did find him, though, was out at Mavericks. He was getting ready to... to do some, uh... 
big wave surfing and we just went, hey, you have a, you have a main event match this week? We need you. So uh, we got him in for his match. And he's uh, back to his high flying wrist taking this with that with that frog splash. And he goes for the pin. One, two. Oh, man. I don't know how he just kicked out. And I'll tell you what. I don't really think he knows either. And a kick to the back of Wildcat from California Kid. A cruiserweight world championship match is on the line in this one. And what a drop kick by Cali Kid. As you can see, Wildcat just go flying off the side of the apron. And Wildcat got the knees up for that standing, uh, standing moonsault. Oh, what a suplex on the outside. The referee is getting close to a three here. These guys got to be careful. Wildcat going back in the ring. California kid shaking himself off, taunting the crowd. Okay, consider that a harsh and Wildcat, oh, hey man, thanks for the lurk. I appreciate it. I really do, Buzz. Are you, are, um, are you going live today, buddy? Out curiosity, Wildcat stretching. California kid. If you're going, if you're gonna go live within like the next five or ten minutes, um, I can always raid you. Cause I've got about another five minutes left, I think. Oh, and Wildcat jumping off the top rope with that drop kick. It's a California kid. He's got him up and drives him into the steel steps. Oh, man. Wildcat working on the face of Cali Kid. There you go, boss. Hey, guys, uh, if you're catching this, whether it's live, whether it's pre recorded, it doesn't matter. You see that link in the chat? Um, that is for uh, Mr. Buzz Live. Go check him out. Go check his Twitch channel out. He's got some awesome shout outs. Um, he's probably one of the best at giving shout outs out of um, all the all the Twitch channels that I go to. Uh, Buzz, you are by far one of the best, my friend. So, um, go check that man out. He is an amazing streamer. And it looks like Wildcat is working on the back of California Kid. They're on the outside. Wildcat with the drop kick, but Kid rolls out of the way. Makes high up, and Wildcat sending, um, Sending California Kid back into the ring. He picks him up. Oh, and what a kick. A kick to the face. Into the pin. One, two. Oh. Wow, that was close. He kicked out at the last minute. Kid just stopping that enziguri from happening. Oh, and he stopped it again. Wildcat went for it a second time. And California Kid with a DDT. Oh, and Kid completely missed the frog splash. As they tie up, kick to the midsection. 
DDT. Here we go. Wildcat in trouble. California kid going to the top rope. And Hironicana into a pin. One, two, only a two. Wildcat kicking out the last second. California kid applying the pressure. He's going to that top rope. And uh, oh man, he landed right on the knees. This is not looking good. Oh! He finally hit that enziguri. One, two, three. And Wildcat getting the win. It almost looked like he used a trouble in paradise to win that. Here we go. Considering that used to be Delvin's finisher, and Delvin is the current Cruiserweight World Champion, he may be sending a message to our world champion here with that with that uh, that move at the end of the match. Damn. You know, Delvin used to use Trouble in Paradise. He's used it for years, but he recently switched to the UFO. Wildcat finishing the match, using it. And wait a minute. Oh, shit. There he is, ladies and gentlemen, the Octane World Cruiserweight Champion, Delvin McLeod, showing up at MXT, sword and all. Holy shit. He probably saw that trouble in paradise and said, oh, hell no. Delvin marching his way down to the ring right now. What in the world? I think we're about to see a face-off between these two gentlemen. We know we're going to see them face off next week. Next week on Octane, these two will face off. As they stare each other down. Oh, man. Well, guys, thank you so much for watching. Um, and I will see you all. Um, I'll see you all next week. Uh, that actually does conclude the show. Um, so, uh, thank you all for showing up. And, um, I'm gonna sign out. I hope you all have an awesome weekend. Thanks, man. I appreciate it. Alright, guys. Have a good one. Beetle out. <laughs> uh, if I can find the stop streaming button, I know it's around here somewhere. Alright guys, laters!